What's up? This is HG News Tech here. So, believe it or not, this I think I noticed it this year that um, this channel has been operational on YouTube for like almost five years since 2017. And I uh, built this channel up to like 200 and whatever subscribers at the moment. And um, I thank you for all of the years and watching. I'm still making videos regardless of this, just what I am. And that's why I started YouTube in the first place. So, thanks and, and happy new year. And um, if you guys want to content, make sure you subscribe and comment like below and share this video because it really helps. As well as subscribing to get this channel off off the ground and hopefully better than it is right now. But um, you know, there's only so many things I can do. Basically, I have a limited schedule, but you know, it's better than nothing. And I'll at least try to schedule these online to the Google platform so it'll automatically release these while uh, of course busy I'm gonna try to do this because I don't think the file size is that big as compared to the iPhone because it's just the desktop and it doesn't use it's like hundred like hundred and nine megs I believe for the last one I just uploaded and that will release sometime on the thirtieth of December of this year. Sometime in the afternoon probably 2 p.m. but uh, this video will be after that so you won't have to hear it but uh, yeah the thing I got was a heated vest which I will wear and of course I can't wear it in the rain but uh, I will will wear it whenever um, it gets colder and there's, there's at least a few days this week where there's no rain but it gets colder and uh, it will be handy. Plus, I think I got a gift card for Subway. For I don't want much. It didn't say the amount, so I have to check that because that's from Santa as well. As well as one of those Dupont uh, basketball shirts, hoodies. I mean, with the black, and I haven't worn that yet because that hasn't been cold enough. So yeah, I'm usually a tech person with when it comes to Linux and um, Windows and. Um, I do remember Windows Vista is the worst OS I ever used, and I believe, I think, you can't even get Windows 7 now anyway. You can't get it online, but, uh, you know, some of the things from Vista and 7 are in 10, of course, but, you know, it's better than um, having the unreliability, and I'll tell you one thing, it's it was a lot unstable, more unstable, basically, back in the day, and, uh, Windows 10 is a lot better, but it's not perfect, but it's better than the 8. 8 was horrible. But slow. I mean, it crashed a lot. It seems like when I got the machine preloaded with it. And um, if I had a choice to go back to Windows 10, I would, but the, the support already ended a few years ago. And um, it'd be nice to at least have the OS preserved, you know, it used, but uh, Microsoft ended the support updates and all that, so even if you did install it on a machine, you wouldn't be able to basically download updates, probably any software that's newer this year probably not work because, you know, it's a different kernel and um, you basically have to deal with it basically, it's out of support, it's outdated, it's like a 2009 OS, it's old, and um, Ten is all right at the moment. I mean, I know I may not be able to upgrade to Windows 11, but um, it's all right. I got at least maybe four years until 2025 October, and then I basically have to get a new machine or format this drive. The whole entire system been Linux on, which I rather not do, but um, I do have Linux distros on a USB drive as well as DVD format. If anything would happen during those five years, I would have the discs that would stay there in their protective envelope, you know. In case, you know, I have, especially when, um, Ubuntu is definitely one of my favorites in the past. I think the latest OS release was horrible this this year, I think, and, uh, I think Marjero is pretty good. Of course, it may be unstable at times, but you know that's what it is. But uh, it is an Arch Linux, uh, Arch based Linux, so it is a little different than Ubuntu. Ubuntu is totally different. 
but it is sealed Linux. I do have a monitor account. I just couldn't find why how to create a monitor account. So I guess it doesn't exist. It's just you have to have the machine, I guess, to use it, I guess, to create the account, I guess. So, whatever. That's better than nothing, but. At least my Jaro is free. Soren OS, I think, it's not free because I looked and you had to pay like fifty dollars, maybe you asked me a little more because uh, the Pro version and all the other features and uh, it's probably every other version. Like if there's a new version, you won't be able to like uh, a few years. I won't be able to upgrade that version to the newest. Cause apparently, it, who knows? But. It's not designed for that. You're designed to get a new OS each time, but I'd rather go the freeway and not have to pay these people every other year. Yes, Linux has come out every six months or so on the cycle, and uh, Chronicle is the, the company who makes Ubuntu, basically, and they've been in business for a long time during the Vista era when Vista was in its worst time frame where it was really unstable, it crashed a lot, it especially a lot of drivers that weren't really compatible and a lot of math writers didn't know how to code for this and uh, it's one of my favorite OS's except for Windows 7, the look I'd rather have than <laughs> this uh, Windows 10 look but you know you have to deal with it because the OS is out supporting you have to deal with it so whatever. Like and subscribe as well. See ya.